Master of Moderation, a documentary about the biography of Dr. Muhammad Ali Husseini, documenting the image and scene of Sayyid Husseini's efforts to show the truth of Islam in the light of extreme extremism. The documentary sheds light in the most important station in the life of Sayyid al Husseini about his achievement in order to consolidate and activate the meanings of a human participant in a global level. The documentary presents the most important works that reflected the man's personality, which creates a hot reputation for the value of moderation and centrality. The Master of Moderation is a documentary about Dr. Hussaini's intellectual, human, religion, and social journey and his Arab and European participations. Dr. Muhammad Ali Hussein is a highly honorable Islamic scholar in the field of religious and secular issues, having great influence and high position in the Arabic and Islamic world. He is highly appreciated and respected in all political, intellectual and religious circles, as well by authoritative sources, scholars and most famous intellectual, religious and political personalities. He is distinguished by his open-minded intellectual and political attitudes and moderate and unistic religious position that rejects separation and sedition propagandists. His eminence enjoys a particular position by all Islamic and non-Islamic communities. His opinions, presentations and ideas are met with a great interest, being based on safeguarding the interests of all in principle, all have the same interests, the same homeland, and the same fate. His eminence is author of more than 70 books on Islamic and political issues, comprised books on jurisprudence, principles, dogma, history, ethics, politics, and Islamic books on general Islamic issues, Muslim encyclopedia, essays, and studies. And some of these books are translated into English. He participated in many Islamic and political conferences in Lebanon and other Arab countries, such as Bahrain, Kuwait, Iraq, Syria, and the EU. The last conference was an imam and a preacher conference in the Kingdom of Bahrain, where he held a Negro address. Dr. Muhammad Ali Husseini traveled to many countries open official invitations, such as Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, where he met the Saudi king. In Bahrain, he met with high-ranking officials. He also visited Kuwait, Iraq, Great Britain, France, Italy, Germany, Denmark, and Sweden, where he participated in events and conferences in the religious and political dialogues. Al Husseini asserts that coexistence and the freedom of religions and the brotherhood in the Abrahamic faith is not legitimate. The destruction of churches, their confiscation, or their taking as refuge, religious fascism, and extremism in the name of deviant Islam does not represent us. The Christian presence in the Arab region is wealth. Dr. Hussein says, Though the Islamic and Jewish faith is believe in the one Lord, and both believe in the prophecy of Abraham and Moses, and share the concept of prohibition and legitimate limits, such as purity, daily prayer, fasting, the veil, the sanctity of it and pork, legitimate culture, commitment and religious responsibility toward the Lord, the necessity and importance of this in the maintenance of peace, security and stability in the world, calling for special and special importance for the Islamic-Jewish dialogue.
In a preparation for the renewal of the religious discourse under the title Civilized Islam, Sidi Hussein stresses the serious importance of reconsidering and guiding the religious discourse in a manner consistent with the moderate and civilized spirit of Islam, which calls for tolerance, peace, peaceful coexistence, and religious pluralism, away from violence, coercion, and extremism. Dr. Muhammad Ali Hussein said, I am addressing you and addressing myself in reminding you and remind myself that no matter how great religious differences and political divisions have increased, and the level of worthy quarrels with each other, who are followers of the method of treason and insulting and boycotting others of taunting them, that make the dialogue door and entrance to them and be the argument on the other through rational debate and civilized communication based on dialogue, God loves the tightness in the whole thing. Dr. Muhammad Ali Hussein emphasized the need for religious scholars to unite and to accept each other and translate their mission in practice through intensive and direct meetings as we are now continue meetings and translating all this into living together in peace, security, tolerance, love and harmony away from hatred and violence. Dr. Muhammad Ali Husseini called on the clergy and the preachers to be aware of the necessity of educating Muslim youth and working hard to save them from drowning in the quagmire of extremism, terrorism, and loss for misguided ideas. However, the basis of fight and terrorism must be intellectually in the wrong visions in the implementation of the proposals and calls for revenge criminal, which is not of religion. Dr. Hussein says, The message of the divine religious is one in the service of men to live together in peace, love, worship, and obedience to Allah. And extremism and religion violence is a satanic commitment committed by the evil people of every religion. The call for moderation, openness, harmony, and tolerance is a divine invitation. Dr. Muhammad Ali Hussein was granted an honorary doctorate as a result of his intellectual and cultural contributions in the Arab countries and the world in promoting a culture of tolerance among different cultures and civilization, and his role in promoting social peace through his thesis calling for respect for Islam, Christian, and Jewish religions, pluralism. The intellectual dialogue framework is far from all forms of moral and material violence. The award in academic committee pointed out that Al Husseini's intellectual activity contributed greatly to the suppression of the Sunni Shiite strife that some regional circles had inflamed. He succeeded in explaining the fabricated and the purely political reasons that stand behind some local conflicts in a number of countries in the region, stressing that they are not connected to the spirit of religions in any way. The committee also welcomed the great role that Sayyid al Husseini played at the international level in the presenting Islam to its truth, which is moderate and open to all religions, which pulled the rug from under the feet of extremism who have worked to antagonize the other in the Arab countries to provoke similar reactions around the world. 
the Supreme Academic Committee concluded that the total contribution of Sayyid Muhammad Ali Husseini served in a clear and comprehensive manner the policy of peaceful coexistence and the culture of civilizational and religious dialogue. Dr. Muhammad Ali Hussein emphasized that the work in cooperation between followers of religions, especially the clergy of different religions, in order to consolidate the concept of tolerance among people, would be the best ground to prevent the danger of extremism, tourism, and cruelty from this world, and giving peace and hope.